Hey yo, what's going on guys and welcome back to another video and in today's video we're going to be talking about when can we see more info on Transformers Reactivate and when we could possibly see the closed beta coming out this year. So it's been a little bit over a month since Transformers Reactivate got officially announced at the Game Awards and we all know how excited everyone got. But now that it's been a little bit over a month and Splash Hammer said themselves that they're not going to really reveal anything else till the new year, we just got to ask ourselves when are we going to see more news? Well, in my honest opinion, again, this is all theorizing. I don't think we're going to get, I don't think we're going to see anything with this game at all probably till late february and if we're lucky the closed beta might be early spring but i think it's going to come out around summertime because we have the new movie coming out so there's going to be a lot of hype building up for transformers and the ip itself so i think we will see a closed beta around summertime and maybe just maybe an actual release in q4 2023 if not a quarter one of 2024 i know that seems like a long time from now but within these next couple months transformers itself is just going to be keep building up the hype and hype because of the new movie coming out this summer we're bound to get a new trailer for that movie anytime soon and with all the other media releasing in these next couple months for transformers there's just going to be a lot of hype building up now when it comes to most game releases they're not just going to come right out of the gate and give you every single information about the game they typically want to build up the hype and that's why i think it works perfectly here for splash damage to release info and i think when they do release info it's going to be a pretty meaty one considering that people have been starting to see a lot of the leaks for this game and the old screenshots like i've shown on the channel and many other youtubers have shown that have been out for years from different developers and different you know names of the game back when it's called transformers impact made by certain affinity so i think when we do see a next either trailer or information about the game it's going to be a pretty meaty one i would expect probably a, a small trailer showing a little bit of gameplay and the story and then probably a blog post following up on what to expect for the closed beta please make sure you guys are signed up for the closed beta i know i am I actually recently got accepted for the press thing for splash damage i didn't even think i would get in so that i mean that's pretty cool i'm not really entirely sure what that means for me but if it means I can get any sort of info early or, you know, whatever it may be, I'm all for it. And as always, I will share more info on the game. Like I mentioned before, there are more screenshots just surfacing from the internet lately from multiple content creators about this game and just more, you know, screenshots and just how the menu and the HUD looks. And I think this game looks pretty good. And I think it'd be perfect for splash damage to kind of just clear the air and you know, either say that stuff that's been shown is either in the game or not in the game, but we would just have to wait see so like i said i probably think we will not see anything for this game till late february and we probably won't see the closed beta for maybe either spring or summer and hopefully a game release in q4 of 2023 but as always i would love to know your guys' thoughts down below leave a like if you're new and subscribe if you guys like that's reactive content and i'll catch you guys the next one all right take care